this journey of life we all strive to know who we are when we are at our best life bowls it us continuous opportunities be it big or small but for us to truly use them shouldn't we know what we have we all have dreams goals bucket lists but how do we tick them off without having a clarity on how we go about it well for me to initially even understand this i sought answers from my guru this very special book called know what you have by swami chinmayananda gives you charge with understanding to push you towards the best of you i'd love to skim through some nuances to give you a glimpse of my learning we are shaped through various envir- environments around us at school college workplace society the culture the book aspects on all of these and tells us how careful study of what the individual mind is capable of will mold you to setting the right path for yourself it says human society is like a machine and its parts if we as individuals as parts are weak the machine won't work so remember you matter much more than you think society gives us various opportunities to hold what we desire but the book reminds us that when you master your mind you master the world the mind is so powerful that if we cultivate noble thoughts we are in control of either making or breaking ourselves the book touches on very relatable issues like identity crisis peer pressure generation gap all of these that most of us have been through while i also learn through the book that through science business and technology i get to learn about the external world but it's philosophy spirituality and self understanding that make us master our inner world what is total personality development how do we go about positive thinking and living it's your time to tap your knowledge about all these hidden realities and now that we've read through the process of self unfoldment what do we do now how do we apply and act upon it this book would give us all a complete understanding of that and how you can strive to your best while knowing what you have on that note i'd like to read to you one of the lines of this book introspect daily detect diligently negate ruthlessly and substitute wisely this is one of my favorite lines and there's a lot more in this book which we youngsters can practically imply in our lives so go ahead and get a copy for yourselves too <music>